Father's car. Long boy, there's nothing for you here. Father, I said move on. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? You can try if you like, and then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get off my land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the mill. I reckon he'd like a proper lordly sword like that. I'll have that sword, boy. Come get it, you bastard. survive <laughs> your sister <laughs> she hid <laughs> I tried to stop them Garrett! Get the Castellan! Tell him his nephew survived! Garrett! Oh, she, uh... They were already dead. Bring the maester! Meet us in the Great Hall! Quickly! Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she. She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's animating, but 
unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Minister. Mm, the blades can't see, but I should be able to save your leg. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Oath will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. I'd do it again if I had the chance. If we don't respond with strength, they won't stop until they have everything. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Hold the wound open for me, would you? the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Better houses than ours are falling in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Well, what will we do now? The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. And though he is young, and altogether unprepared to lead. This might hurt a bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. It's not odd, though, that he chose to save you. Why, not his son, Roderick. It's not that Roderick couldn't handle it himself. He's as good with a sword as any man I've seen. He gave me a message to deliver. A message? About what? What did he tell you? Get my uncle. I was told only to tell him. Your uncle? I see. Must be rather important then. Lady Forrester will be here any moment now. I'd like you to walk for me first. To see if you can put any weight on that leg. Ugh. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. London, I suppose. Although, I wonder if they'll bring her home. Why, never easy being a fourth-born son. Lord Forrester, it was an honor to squire for you. Gregor the Good. Roderick, he was our best warrior by far. been kind to me, treated me like I was a forester myself. Talia and Ethan, I suppose Lord Ethan now. Asha, exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Hmm, you seem to be favoring it. It's always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, case what needed. Look. I'll show you. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? 
They smile. Does your leg feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Who is the new lord of House Forrester? Why, Inkers, of course. At the Citadel. I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. Advising the late Lord Forrester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is challenging. There's still so much he has to learn, yet the very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. Which is rather frightening when you think about it. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Only time will tell, but... Lady Forrester. Welcome home, Gareth. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Jared, I heard what happened. Is it true? Is your family... So sorry. Thanks, Alice. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Just telling me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. You saved my life, my lady. Yet not Broderick's. You were with Broderick, huh? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if he can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He. He fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told, I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed? He asked me to return this to House Forrester. He said this is where it belongs, with his family. Thank you, Gareth. Of course, my lady. If their fans are responsible, it's too dangerous, especially now. Now is the time to prove our worth. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Duncan, this was our land. They were our people, your family. I share your outrage, Sir Roy. I do, but now is not the time to provoke the white girls. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Gareth, do you understand what this means? You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones who should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. They killed my family. And they'll pay for what they've done. That much, I promise. But now is not the time for vengeance. If not now, when? We have to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Gareth has lost as much as anyone else within these walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Gareth suffered enough already. You asked too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. It was his family they killed. We should demand justice. Ah, justice on their terms, which means they'll have your head. Justice is taken, not demanded. Then what's to be done? <sighs> Ultimately, it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this will accuse you of murder and us of protecting you. 
the boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. I've done nothing wrong. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take. Which is why we cannot stay. Cannot stay? Johnson, but, but where would I go? The one place beyond the reach of even Hal's bolters. You're sending him to the war? The boy's done nothing wrong. Not in the eyes of the Boltons. I'm afraid it's the only solution. Especially now, when the house is so vulnerable. I'll do what's best for the house. So I'll go. I'm not afraid. I know it doesn't seem fair, but it is what's best. That settles it. my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food, but we haven't much time. The White Tails will come looking for us. Word off to me. I gladly drive a sword through Lord White Tails' heart to give him a chance. I would. And God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the House ahead of your own. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. I'll do what's best. Which often isn't what's easiest, but necessary nonetheless. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. What? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said, the North Road can never be lost. Sorry, you caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed, if ever. What is the North Road? Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wild knights and fools, and it's better kept that way. You haven't told anyone else, have you? This is important, Garrett. I need to know the truth. Of course not. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. From this day forward, this will be our secret. And soon, I may need your help. What? I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Road may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at war. Become a ranger if you can. It will help. Represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll make you proud. You already have. Jared, wait! Find him, did you? He's high. 
once do. And if he was smart, he would reveal himself. I don't like this game anymore. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. He's just forgotten this is a game. You found me! Well done, Ryan. Don't worry. It's just a game, Ryan. Stupid game. I don't like it. He was worried you were gone. I thought he'd never find you again. I'm right here. And I promise, I'm not going anywhere. I wish Mia was here. And Asher. And... and Roderick. I do too. But Mia is in King's Landing and... Once she comes home, I don't want her to die too. Ryan, she's perfectly safe, I promise you. I don't want Dad to die either. Maester Ortengen said he got sent to the wall. I'll miss Jared. He was nice. Jared is strong. He can take care of himself. No one will tell me what Jared did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Roiland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Everyone's worried about you, but I'm not. I know you're protected. Who said they're worried about me? Well, Sir Roiland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? And he called you a milksop. Sir Roiland forgets himself. He doesn't know me or, or what I'm capable of. What does milksop mean? I don't know, but I know it's not good. Ethan, you should let Sir Roiland teach you how to wield a sword, like, like a man. He taught Roderick and Asher, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. A lord should know how to fight. Asher, we'd all be out here for hours. Yeah. Where was I? You weren't born yet. It's so much fun. But then, you, and everything changed. Roderick became so serious, the Lord in training. He never smiled anymore. And Asher, Asher just got angry at everything. Promise me you won't be like that. Please, just be you. I like you the way you are. I know a lord has many responsibilities, but you don't need to be like them. I promise I won't change. Good, because I'd rather have a brother than a lord. You'll have to have both, I'm afraid.